Gonzaga, I, I'm, I'm locked in on them as the uh, what should be a, the, the champion this year. Um, and then I'm also convinced that Crutwig from, uh, from Loyola is the star of the tournament. So we all love Sister Jean, but Loyola is the team we got to be rooting for. And I'm actually convinced that, that they, could, they could win the whole thing. Like, I'm, I'm still signed with Gonzaga, but, but I'm convinced it's possible, and, and I'm, I'm almost pulling for that as well simultaneously. Uh, but, but Crutwig, man, he gives us all hope. What, what a legend he is. So, so he's my guy. I'm all in on him. Um, and then I, I, I'm also convinced of this, that with all the upsets that we saw this weekend, Oral Roberts and Albaline Christian and all these different teams, they are just as exciting as ever. The upsets are just as exciting as ever. But I, I'm convinced they don't have the same shock value that they used to. Like, like in the past, when we saw top teams like you know Duke or Kentucky or Kansas, like when those teams get upset and they go down, there's a level of shock and surprise and you got to be kidding me and, and, and what in the world is happening. This year, we, we went in knowing that it was wide open knowing that that anybody could win. And, and sometimes we'll say that, but this year in particular, just because of the way the, the, the Rona affected people and teams were you know in and out and uh, you know guys in and out of the lineup, all that sort of thing. So the the emphasis on senior laden teams, teams that that were in the tournament you know two years ago, we're seeing them play well or coaches that you know we can count on year in year out. Jim Beheim, you know those kind of those kind of guys, uh, that's who we can trust. So as fun as the upsets have been, they're not that surprising. So the emotion is still excitement. We love it. I'm pulling for upsets. Let's go. Let's bring in, bring on the upsets. But I'm not going, are you kidding me? I can't believe that Loyola knocked off Illinois. It's believable. It's Who's Illinois, right? I mean, we, I, I haven't thought about Illinois since Darren Williams. How many years ago was that? That was 2005. 